Hi everyone, it's Matt here from Greatness Every Day and in this video I'm really excited to share with you some of the intentions that I set at the beginning of this year and tell you whether or not I met those intentions, I exceeded them, or I didn't quite meet them and explain some of my thoughts and reasons uh, behind why that happened. So I'm excited to be honest and transparent with you about these goals that I had for the year 2019 as well as uh, kind of document my journey digitally so that in 5, 10, 15 years, I'm able to look back on these intentions and really see how they fit into my overall long-term personal growth. So I'm excited to share with you and be uh, just honest and open about some of the things that I had planned for this year and some of my struggles, some of my journeys, um, some of the things that went real well, some of the celebrations, and explain to you how you can do the same. So if you watch this entire video, at the end of the video, I'm giving you my free 2020 intentions guide. So you can go um, watch the video and learn how to get that at the end. So thanks for being here. Uh, I just start out by taking my intentions and it's something that I visit every day. And so uh, at the beginning of the year, I sat down and I said, okay, what are some of the things that I want to do in this upcoming year to make sure that the year 2019 is solid, to make sure the year 2019 is a great year for me. Um, and so I'm going to share with you one by one some of these intentions and evaluate and reflect upon whether I met them or not. So I'd really encourage you to go down in the comments below. If you have any comments or questions, uh, please let me know and I'll do my best to get back to you here. Let's get started. So the very first one that I had was to pray or meditate uh, five minutes every single day. And that's something that I can check off and say, I did this. I did this way more often um, than I probably thought I was going to. Um, and it became way more of a real um, solid piece of my day uh, every single day, multiple times a day. So I'm happy to say that I met that intention. Number two is exercise every day. Now, people that know me are going to say this is probably something that I, I've never really had a problem with. And that one was very, very consistent throughout my life. Uh, and as well in the year 2019, whether it was big exercise or small exercise, I was always doing something consistently to maintain that. Uh, though I do have big plans for the next year when it comes to exercise. Uh, number three was eat a healthy diet. And as I go through this and I look at um, some of my intentions that I've had, uh, one of the big piece to keeping me on track with my intentions or not is through uh, recording my day-to-day my -day thoughts and experiences in a journal. And as I go back through my journal entries, one of the pieces, the very last question is uh, basically, what could I have done today to make my day better, right? So um, I noticed time and time again, it was always, uh, there were so many times that it focused in on, on the food that I ate and a healthy diet. And I said, I could have eaten better. I could have eaten better. I could have chose uh, a better supper or a better lunch. So this is something that I have to say, I'm going to give myself um, a not good grade on that. So I didn't meet my intentions. There were times throughout the year where I did eat very healthy. And then there were times in the year where I didn't. Um, and this is something as I knew, as I know moving forward that I really have to focus in on. Uh, the next one is something that I'm really excited to say that I've hit. I uh, hit 1,000 subscribers on both of my YouTube channels. So um, I have two YouTube channels, obviously Greatness Every Day here, and then another channel called The How To Scholar. It's uh, an educational uh, channel because what I do in my daytime is I'm a high school teacher, and I hit 1,000 subscribers on both of those channels. Uh, one of them was very early on, and then Greatness Every Day now is, is uh, as you can see down in the bottom of your screen. And if you're not subscribed, go ahead and click that button for me. But I'm really excited to say that that was a big milestone for me to hit 1,000 subscribers on both of my YouTube channels, just from consistent work um, and providing value to people. So that was exciting. And the fifth intention that I had was to earn $10,000 from the internet. And I knew this was a big goal when I started the year. Um, and I didn't quite live up to that. And uh, when I did start the year though, I did make some growth as I started a coaching program and I was able to monetize that. And then throughout the end uh, of the year, I really felt my time, um, as I've told people here before, I started greatness every day just under two years ago. And I said, I'm going to work for two years without anybody noticing me. Uh, without profiting anything from it um, through ads and different revenue and such like that. Uh, but 
I am excited to say that I've done that in the past. I didn't come anywhere close to meeting $10,000, but I have started the important process of monetization and I definitely have a plan uh, to provide value and receive value for that value that I'm providing as we move into the next year. So that's exciting. Uh, number six was to speak in front of 100 plus people. And I really had no clue how this was going to happen when I went ahead and set this intention. Um, but in June of uh, this year, I was able to speak in front of a crowd of about, of about 400 people. Uh, and that went really, really well. And I had a lot of fun doing that. So I am looking for more opportunities to continue speaking in front of people. Uh, number seven was to recognize when I'm low on energy and not just recognize it, but change it. And that was something that consistently, because I was reviewing these intentions each and every day, as I kept them in my journal, I was consistently monitoring my energy. And when I was tired, I was making sure that I'm going to bed early or making sure that I stopped uh, the work that I had to do for uh, that day that was able to be pushed to another day and really prioritizing my energy levels this year. Because in the past, this is something that I've really kind of neglected to look at. So I'm happy to say that I have done that. Uh, number eight was to travel to two new countries. And as although I had good intentions of doing that, um, I didn't, no excuses, I just didn't. And number nine is to monetize my YouTube accounts. And I'm happy to say that I have done that. I have a pretty exciting, what I think is an exciting plan to monetize um, greatness every day uh, as I move forward here into things like um, YouTube ads, obviously, which is something that um, doesn't take away from the people that I'm providing value to. Uh, at the same time, I have, gone online and made an online coaching program, which is exciting. Uh, online courses, eBooks, affiliate marketing are all other ways that I'm considering monetizing uh, what I do here. Because if you can make a, a couple hundred dollars a month or a couple thousand extra dollars a month um, on a side business like the internet can do for you, uh, that's a huge game changer. So uh, those are the intentions that I had for this year. Um, I'm really going to step it up throughout this next year. I'm going to step it up for a few reasons. Number one is I understand why um, setting goals, even if they're big, even if you don't think that you might necessarily achieve them, setting goals is really important uh, just to raising the quality of life that you have for yourself. So let me know down in the comments below if you agree with what I just said there or not. And if you want to go ahead and set goals for your next year, I'm going to leave a link down in the video description below and down in the comments where you can go ahead and get my free 2020 intention setting guide. Uh, you just have to put your email in there and then go ahead and click the link and I'm sending in, sending it to you for free. You can download that and use that to establish the intentions that you have for your next year as you want to live your greatest life possible. So if this video helped you, please click the thumbs up button, subscribe to our channel and follow us on Instagram for daily inspiration and encouragement to live a great life. You can also visit our website at www.greatnesseveryday. So that's G-R-8-N-E-S-S everyday.com. Thanks for watching and remember, Choose greatness every day.